Yesterday you won twice, today you won once. Do you think that might be that you're not one of the favorites? Yeah, in the laser class you have always a lot of sailors that uh, can do well. I'm glad with my performance so far, but uh, I know that it's still uh, a lot of way to go. We still have uh, three tough races tomorrow with strong wind and then uh, the finals. And we all know that in the uh, World Championship in laser, especially in the finals, that the results can change really fast. So I try to take it uh, day by day, race by race, uh, try to always do my best, to minimize the mistakes. And uh, then we see until the end, uh, could be able to sail the best all these six days. Because sailing is sort of uh, consistency, it's not just about uh, winning. Of course, I'm happy to win, but uh, also, second place and third places are also really good races to count, and uh, I'll try to do my best until the end. And you're practicing often here in Split, so you have a creation coach. So do you feel a bit at home here? Do you know like what it feels like? Yeah, of course I feel uh, at home here. Uh, I came here first time 2006, so it's 11 years uh, ago. I have uh, same coach like uh, Tonchi Stepanovic and Filip Jurisic. Uh, Mr. Jozo Jakelic and uh, we all train together and we are like a small family and uh, yeah I feel uh, it's like my home here. Okay. And what's your comment of the today's race? How has it been? How? How has it been today? Yeah it, it was uh, nice conditions today. Uh, unfortunately the wind arrived late so we couldn't do the second race but uh, we have uh, very nice conditions tomorrow to pack it up with three races. Giovanni, uh, you were in the uh, last fleet to race today. Uh, how much different was that to the two races yesterday? Uh, well, it was tricky as yesterday, as it's usually in split. Uh, the wind was uh, quite uh, nice at the beginning, and then was starting to drop a bit and to turn on the right. And uh, yeah, I was happy to manage to get a top 10, which is a solid result. And uh, so far has been a good uh, two days. Okay, uh, you probably haven't seen the results uh, yet, but where, where are you standing overall now? Uh, I'm, I'm not watching the results right now, I'm just sailing each uh, race, uh, race by race, and then, yeah, enjoying every single race. Okay, uh, three races tomorrow, early bed tonight, <laughs> what will your preparations be? Yeah, we will do some recovery now, and then, um, like every day after sailing, it's recovery time, and then hope to be ready for tomorrow. Lorenzo, um, one race today, uh, how was it for you? Well, pretty uncharacteristic for me. I slammed on the brakes on the first downwind and uh, tried to make it all back up on the second downwind and also the beat, but uh, managed to pull back up to 12th, which uh, I'm pretty okay about, but still could have been a lot better. Okay, a long way to go, but currently you're just behind your fellow countryman and a double world champ or defending world champion, Nick Thompson. Does that feel good? Well, you can't really think about these things. It doesn't really matter in the laser class because, you know, if you start thinking like that, everyone just goes past you. So uh, you just have to think for yourself and take it easy and race by race, really. Okay, it seems like it's going to be a big day tomorrow with three races and the wind's going to get stronger. How do you fancy your chances? Well, I have to hike hard, hike hard and be smart, so. Okay, but are you happy about that? Do you rather sell the uh, heavy stuff or the light stuff, or? Uh, like yesterday, I was quite comfortable in the light stuff, but uh, more time to think, but uh, no, nah, I'll give it my best shot and uh, see how it goes from there. 